Hey guys, so in today's video, I wanted to film a quick drugstore makeup look for you guys. And I'm just starting off with priming my eyelids with just a concealer. Um, and I'm priming my eyelids today because the eyeshadows that I'm going to use don't show up too well on my skin tone. And yeah, so I'm just blending that into my lids. And then I'm going to be taking my Carity Picante palette. I told you guys that I had a bunch of uh, bunch of looks that I wanted to film with this, but I'm trying to space them out so I don't overload you guys with it. But um, the first shade that I'm taking is Pimento, and I'm just applying that into my crease and slowly building up the color. Now, had I not used the concealer, you guys would not have been able to see this at all, even though it's barely showing up on camera now. But yeah. And the second shade that I'm using in my crease is called Bobby, and it has a hint more, a hint more of orange in the shade. So I'm building that up as well in the crease, and I'm still using the same brush that I used before. And I'm doing a voiceover because I was watching Golden Girls while I was filming this. I've seen Golden Girls every episode at least 10 times. I rewatch it on Hulu all the time. Um, for my lid shade, I am taking this pretty shimmer shade and it's called Bronzed. And I'm just applying that with my dense eyeshadow brush. And I did dampen this before I applied the shade just to make it more intense. And then I'm just popping on my Alexa lashes that I got from shopmissay.com. And I'm trying out the ColourPop foundation for the first time. And you guys, that look, that foundation is so runny. Um, but it applied nicely. Um, they had this sale going on at the beginning of the year where you could buy a full face of makeup for $20. And in that came foundation, concealer, and a setting powder. And so I figured why not take advantage of that deal. It was a little hard to find my foundation shade because when I did the little foundation shade match thing, it uh, and I used my Fenty foundation to match it, the shade looked a little bit too dark in the pictures. So I think I went up a shade or two and I chose the shade um, medium dark 145. And then for a concealer, I think I went up two shades on this as well and medium 28 um, I actually like these products so far but at the end of the day y'all my face is and it's not even that long like I'll wear it to work and I'll work for about five or six hours and I come home and my face is a greasy mess and I've tried it with setting powders I've tried no primer and I've tried a mattifying mattifying primer so far and no matter what my face is greasy at the end of the day I wish I took pictures so that I could insert it for you guys but I'm just blending this in with my real technique sponge and then for the setting powder I almost always choose the banana powder no matter what brand no matter what setting if it's loose or if it's a compact I always choose banana because the translucent powders do tend to look ashy on those black folks so just to be on the safe side I choose banana and I'm setting everywhere that I highlighted and concealed at and then I'm just lightly dusting the excess powder away And to add some color back to my face, I'm taking my Beauty Treats Contour Palette and I'm taking um, one of the lighter bronzer shades and using it as a blush and then I'm just bronzing up my forehead.
and I just like to apply my blush to the apples of my cheeks I don't like to bring it too far back and then for a highlight I'm using my Maybelline highlighter and applying it with a small fan brush And then for my under eyes, I am taking the same two shades that I used in my crease and the same brush and just applying this to the under eyes. And then for lips, to top this look off, I'm just using a shimmery brown lip gloss. I've been really into lip gloss lately instead of wearing lipstick, so that's what I'm doing right now. And I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see y'all in my next one. Bye. Don't play with a dog. 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 Don't be the same.